Hello everyone and welcome back to Smart Gadgets. Today we're going to review the brand new WeLight K21 RGB LED light stick. We will be seeing what we have in the box, design, what materials it is made of, what options we have. Also we will run some tests to see what it does. We'd also like to thank our sponsor Viltrox for making this video possible. The link where and how to buy this device is in the description down below. Before we start, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. So here we've got the box itself, and we're going to open it and see what's inside. So first up is the light itself, and then we have the instruction manual which comes in a variety of languages and shows you how to set it up and use it properly so if you want you can give it a red before you use it. Next, we have a USB Type-C charging cable to charge the device. So now let's get to the actual device, and as you can see it has some plastic cover which we're going to take off right away, and now we can look at the device. This K21 full-color handheld RGB LED light stick from WeLight is a unique light tube that measures 12-inch and has extensive color control. It adopts 160 PCS color rendering lamp beads. It can be used as a side light, a dramatic main light, or for lighting hard-to-reach spaces. The light has an expansive CCT color range of 2500 to 8500K to deal with ambient light, match other fixtures, or just produce creative effects. The light has an internal rechargeable 3.7V-2500 mAh battery that will give you 60 minutes of runtime at full power and it takes 3 hours for fully charge and supports used while charging. The fixture has a flat side which keeps it from rolling, and built-in magnets at both ends allow you to attach it to most metal surfaces. So now we're going to turn it on and see the options on it. First it has a brightness control where you can adjust them from 0 to 100% based on how bright you want it to be and what color you want. It has an RGB mode with hue, saturation, and intensity control that gives you access to literally millions of custom colors. The tube is dimmable from 0 to 100% you can adjust these settings locally on the fixture, and it changes colors when you turn them up or down, and the intensity speed turning them on and off as you want, like you can see right here. You can also make them at distances up to 65 foot using a smartphone and WeLight's free app which we'll talk about later. The light stick also boasts 29 special effects including flash, alarm, film and TV, rainbow, bar, birthday, fairy tale, grassland, waves, aurora, red, orange, yellow, green, cyan, blue and purple. If you don't understand the options it has, you can always look at the user manual where it has all the information you need to know how to use it. We also have the QR code for the app which it uses. It works for both iOS and Android so you just need to choose the code based on the one you have. So, we're going to take our phone and scan it with our camera, which will send us a link for the app and we can install it on the Play Store. As you can see here, we've got the WeLight Pro app which we are going to install really fast and see how to connect it with our device and what kind of options and settings does it has inside. After we've successfully installed it let's open it up and take a look. First, we need to connect our device with the app and you can see the letters A, B, C, D, E and F which are used as a station of the device which the app can hold up to 6 devices to control. Right now, it's stationed on A so what we need to do is take the light and go set it up in station A like you can see right here on how to do it. Now we can see that we've connected it successfully and we can turn it on and off as we want. The first option we've got is an expansive CCT, 
or correlated color temperature color range of 2500 to 8500 K to deal with ambient light, match other fixtures, or just produce creative effects, and you can change the brightness from 0 to 100%. Next, we have HSL for hue, saturation and lightness levels where we have a spectrum of different colors to choose from and the levels that you want those colors to have and the mass of light you want to emit. After that we've got the RGBWI which are the acronyms for red, green, blue, white and yellow so basically how much of those colors you want on your light. This is a great option because you can create hundreds of wonderful combinations of lights. Next, we've got the XY coordinates where we can pinpoint any color we want by selecting the X and Y coordinates on the chromaticity diagram that we can see here. The next option is the color chip where we can find samples of different colors that we can use on our light, and as you can see, we have a big variety to choose from and choose on how bright you want these colored lights to be. In the option fix we've got 29 special effects including flash, alarm, film and TV, fireworks, SOS rainbow, bar, birthday, fairy tale, grassland, waves red, orange, yellow, green, cyan, blue and you can change the speed of these effects from 1 to 3. If we turn the lights off, we can have a better look on how the light affects the room, and how it lights up in the dark, and as you can see, it will change the color of your room immediately. Finally, last, we have the camera option so we can take pictures and videos with our phone while changing the settings on our light. So, guys this was pretty much on the Wii Light K21. This is one of the best RGB light wands you'll ever use. It's very practical, and it's a must-have on my list so I strongly suggest it for you as well. And another thing, Viltrox, the sponsor of this video, and the maker of this product, is holding a global photo contest where you can win a lot of great prizes. The information about the contest, and how to enter the contest is in the link down below. This was all for today's video. I hope you find this video interesting and helpful, if so, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and I'll see you in the next video with another smart device.